game is against that goalie where I sold my gear to and I can never beat him. And just another one that we're playing against and he's usually really good and usually shuts me out. So it's always a tough one. For this game, nothing crazy going on besides I forget my jersey, which I've done a lot this year and maybe I'm just getting old and forgetful and that's unfortunate. But really, I just hang stuff to dry and sometimes I just forget that it's hanging to dry instead of grabbing it where it should be and I should just pay more attention to that. The other part for this game, I'm not gonna go into gear stuff because there's nothing really to talk about that I haven't talked about previously for specific things. It's just was going to be like basically my playoff setup for this team and I decided to change the glove later down the line, but I just felt so good in this and so comfortable. My movements felt great. My post integration felt great. I had a couple of really bad rebounds where I just totally whiffed on the blocker. That was a mistake, but everything else besides that felt really good. And I just felt really good in this game. And I think you can kind of see it. Everything looks at it was like kind of going as planned for the most part, minus that one really bad blocker save. And my team did an awesome job of shot blocks and everything. So very interesting game. It's close. So that's always a good thing in beer league. And We'll see how this one ends up. I've had people ask me over and over again of what socks I always recommend. And I've been using Cut Shield for a while now and I have multiple stuff for them. So Cut Shield is a company out of Canada that makes cut resistant socks. And these are their Pro Air 6, which means it's an ANSI level six for cut resistance on here. They also make pretty awesome slash guards and wrist guards. You see them in the NHL a lot. Basically look for this gray material under players' gloves and under their elbow pads and it's probably cut shield. This version of it has an Evo shield piece in, so you have slash guard and it's skate cut resistant. This stuff is fantastic and I absolutely love it. I've been using it for a long time. Did a full review of it up there so you can check it out. But I now have a coupon code with cut shield. So if you wanna support the channel, you can check out the link in the description to cut shield, buy some socks, which I think are honestly one of the better socks on the market. I absolutely love them. They're pretty thin and they are cut resistant and they're not too hot either. And I have no issues with these whatsoever on my custom skates where I need a really thin one. You can see how you can basically see my skin through them so they are thin on here and this part doesn't really feel or get that hot compared to some of those kevlar socks so i absolutely love this material so check them out i always recommend them use my coupon code you get 25 percent off and it helps support the channel so i can keep making videos and making more content otherwise if you want to support the channel without buying anything check out links in the description to patreon buy me a coffee everything through there comes again back into the channel so i can make more content and doing real reviews
So as you could see, it was very close and my D did a lot of shot blocking. My team did a lot of shot blocking and they made a couple awesome plays and really laid it out, which is a lot to ask for in beer league. I'm not asking them to do that, but they did it. So that's pretty awesome. And we ended up managed to get a 2-1 win, which again, beer league, so it's pretty solid overall. And the only goal here is kind of a play where it hits off my D stick and it totally changes direction. I think he was shooting this right at me. It looked like it was going right at me. I don't think I was gonna move at all for it. And it hit my D stick and just kind of goes in off the post. Right away, my D partner apologized and said that went off me, that's my bad. And it is what it is. It was a play that ended up as a nice shot after the tip, just goes straight in. So unfortunately things just happened, so that is what it is. But again, awesome game overall for my team. This is a solid team to play against and keeping them down to one goal against is really good and beating them is also pretty solid because we always end up playing them in the playoffs and are always tough for that too. So looks like that's gonna happen again. We'll see how that one ends up. You're watching hockeyreviews.ca.